We're in Windows 10. I'm going to show you how to turn on remote access so you can remote into your computer when you're away. Just go ahead and open up Control Panel. If you can't find it, just click on the Start button, type Control Panel in the box. Control Panel comes up, and from here we're going to go ahead and click on System. And everything's alphabetical there, so you can just click on, uh, find the S's, click on System. And then from there you're going to click on Remote Settings. Now, in Remote Settings, it, by default it says you do not allow anyone to connect to this computer, so you're going to click on Allow. It says that this computer is set to go to sleep or hibernation when not in use. While the computer sleeps, you may not be able to get into it, so we're going to have to go into Power Options to make that change. All right, so uh, we right now we've got Allow, but it says Allow Connections Only from Computers Using Remote Desktop with Network Level Authentication. So that basically means Windows XP with the latest update or newer, so Windows Vista 7, 8, 8.1, uh, if you have this box checked. If you uncheck it, then any version of Remote Desktop is uh, going to be allowed to log in if you have the right username and password, but the security will be lower. Click on Select Users, and by default, our default user of the letter X already has access. If you want, you can go ahead and add in other users just by typing the name in. If they're, if they're already uh, created in uh, the computer's account, then you can add them at that time. And when you're done, just click OK, and click Apply, and click OK.